So you're still having that black screen issue by OBS and or any of your other recording programs that you have out there. We're gonna get right into some updates for 2024 and we'll see you on that segment. Okay, so we made a video back in 2022 about the OBS black screen, and we're just gonna go over this real quickly. I mean, we made several videos. You can revert back to those videos, watch those if there's some other tips or other helpful uh, techniques within those. Uh, but a lot of you guys are having black screen issue. We talked about switching over to Firefox um, to, of course, prevent that black screen issue. It does still currently work. It is January of 2024. It does still work. Here's the problems that some of you guys are having out there um, with it still blocking your screen. If you're using Firefox, depending upon um, if you're using Windows platform, Apple, whatever it may be, every settings are different. This is the problem that it's usually in your settings. So we're gonna get into it. We're going to talk about that. We're going to talk about the settings and how to prevent that. So two things within if you're using Firefox, one, it could either be we're going to get right into the Firefox. I'm going to show you Firefox. I'm going to switch over to that screen. Here I am in a Firefox screen. Now, this is Firefox. If it looks different to you guys out there, this is underneath their basically you're going underneath their, the side menu here and you're going underneath the settings for the security and the settings right here and then you just go through all the security and privacy settings so this is this is a problem too with some of you guys out there firefox does set up its own settings and blocks some of these so you just got to turn off um, a lot of these settings you know kind of you have to test go through um, mess with it a little bit and it will you know correct the issue in most cases this is the same case with many of the other platforms such as google and um if you're using Explorer, I don't know what, whatever you're using, you just have to, if you have some issues, just send it to us directly in an email or a comment and we'll put a video together to try to help that and resolve that issue to that. So the next thing is hardware acceleration. Hardware acceleration is a very easy fix and this does block a lot of the issues. And what happens is many times with your guys' computers, especially Windows, and I hate it, it updates all the time and it forces the update. So if your computer updates, it's gonna automatically put in new systems, change all your settings, and it will change your hardware acceleration setting. And then you're like, oh, now the black screen's not working. They must have done something on Firefox. It's not that, it's, it's, it's basically uh, Windows setting your settings for you. So basically you'll wanna you know, go into this screen here and type in your search and you just ch change, change, resolution um, and then you'll see it pops up change the resolution of your display so if you click on change resolution or you can also click on hardware acceleration it'll go down through and it'll tell you how to turn off the hardware acceleration if you guys are having uh, issues with it but just change the resolution of your screen and you can go down here and you, you see the graphics and settings and go into graphics and settings and you'll see here that we have uh, the the hardware acceleration currently off on our computer it's totally off so this doesn't you know block all of our issues that we're of course having with uh, you know the recording so that's why ours works so if you turn that off and get that readjusted it will should stay off now if it doesn't as i said microsoft does update apple does update all these update so if your hardware is uh, still currently on, turn it off. Now, another uh, that I usually don't like to mention a lot of times is a third, uh, you know, resolution to the issue, but it's all paid apps. We don't get into these paid apps because it, it can be kind of a fiasco. It's kind of a mess. You can download apps that block out um, basically like, especially you know, many of you asked about ESPN and recording games and doing, you know, quick segments on games. Uh, most of the time it will work through your report recording program if you turn off the hardware accelerations and you turn off all the security settings but those of you that have apple apple is a pain in the butt to use there is app programs that you can buy and it basically overrides apple reading that you're screen recording it or um, anything's being recorded 
and it blocks that and it will allow it to record it. So you guys can look up those apps. We don't recommend them. That's why we're not gonna put them in this video. Uh, but there, there are some apps that will block that out and I just don't think they're worth the money and they just don't seem to work real well a lot of times. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. We've tested a couple of them and they, we just don't need them, uh, but we test them and didn't really care for them. So that's basically how you get the screen recording fixed for 2024. Put in the comments, you know, make sure you do like these videos. We'll keep trying to do, you know, update videos if there's other questions, other issues, things that, you know, may not work for you guys. Uh, but these are the two most important steps that typically always work is the security settings within Firefox or even your browser and the hardware acceleration is the big thing. Hardware acceleration, turn it off, get it reset and it should work for you. So we'll see you in the next video.